Welcome back fellow techies to our latest tutorial video. I am the Technician Project and today's tutorial is how to add and remove effects in Adobe Audition. So we're going to start off our project today with Adobe Audition open and an audio file inserted into a multi-track project. And as we said before, we're going to insert effects onto that track. So we've selected our track and you can do it by track effects or clip effects. So we're going to go to effects at the top here and we're going to add an effect. So this is the simplest way to do it. Click on our track and add an effect. And we're just going to add an EQ. There we go. And we're going to add a 30, 30 band EQ. Just gives us a graphic equalizer and we're just going to select one of these equalizers here just pick any one at random that's it and you can see the equalizer is showing and we're just going to affect the eq now by just messing around with some of these these faders and you can hear the difference already That's it off. This is the EQ on. So you can automatically hear that I've messed with the EQ a lot to have a play. You can add EQ by using the EQ section on the left. You can add effects. So we're using the track effects and we're adding effects to the track. So there's a dynamic range. So we can add that on the left hand side in the effects section, or we can add that in the effects tab at the top. As you can see here, we're just messing around effects in the dynamic range to show that the effects are working. Turn both blows off. There you go. Something we've done something really random just to show you how the effects are working. Now to remove an effect, dead simple. You click on the little thing, little uh, triangle at the end, and press remove effects. We remove all those effects. Now when you remove or add an effect, it creates a keyframe at the bottom. Uh, to show your history of the keyframes. Now you can add it per clip or you can add it for the track and we've just been doing it for track one is what we've been editing is track one and not the clip. So you can do that per track if you hit track two, track three, you can add all these effects to it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more. And also, ding dong that notification bell to get further updates. Thanks again. Goodbye.